Are you ready for some good news? God loves you and wants you to love yourself. Today's text uh, is from Proverbs chapter 19, verse 8, the New Living Translation. To acquire wisdom is to love yourself. So if you're wise, you'll not only love yourself, but you'll also help others love themselves. Charlie Shedd, in his classic little book, Letters to Philip, tells his son Phil about a day that a young woman named Frances met him at his minister's study. Knowing how Charlie loved to hear success stories, the attractive, confident wife wanted to share with her pastor why she thought her mate, Mac, uh, Mark, was the best husband in the world. She said, from the day I started school, clear up to college, everyone made fun of my legs. As you can see, they look like tree stumps, she said, as she voluntarily stood up to display them. And Pastor Shedd saw that, yes, they did look like tree stumps. But at the same time, he was amazed. She didn't seem embarrassed in the least by this unusual bodily feature. She continued, Sometimes when I was little, I'd cry myself to sleep. In high school, I dated some, but never more than a couple of times with any one boy. And, well, you can guess why, she said. And Frances soon shared how she had met Mark in college and how much she liked him right away. And though Mark never once commented about her legs, she often did. You know, she said, looking for assurance, always trying to get some affirmation because she was worried about it. Well, one night, she said, Mark took Frances's hands, looked her in the eye, and spoke clearly. Frances, I want you to quit knocking yourself. I love you the way you are. The Lord gave you good, sturdy legs. They give me a solid feeling, and I like it. Well, there in the atmosphere of Mark's love and acceptance, some deep place in Frances softened, and she cried with hope and joy as she began to accept herself. Sometime later, Mark took Frances home to meet his mother, and Frances nearly melted when she saw her boyfriend's mom. She had a disability in one of her legs. She wore a built-up shoe and walked with a noticeable limp. Here's what Francis told Pastor Shedd about that moment with her boyfriend. I looked at him, and he looked at me, and I think I loved him right then like nobody ever loved a man before. That was 13 years ago, she said, and now I can honestly laugh about my legs. What happened? Until that marvelous moment, Mark loved Frances, but Frances didn't love herself. He accepted her, but she couldn't accept herself. If we don't believe ourselves accepted, we remain afraid. Mark's love, as priceless and beautiful as it was, didn't cure Frances's insecurity. It was only when Frances accepted herself that her fear was banished. God loves you and wants you to love yourself. Whoever loves herself, loves wisdom. That's what the proverb says, and that's the gospel. That's today's daily devotional. For more like it, click right here. Or better yet, subscribe, get them all. And I uh, hope you have a wonderful day in which you love yourself.